In this video, we will learn indexing and reshaping of tensors. We will make a tensor and we will see how we can do indexing and reshaping. Let's import TensorFlow STF. We will make a tensor and store in the variable x. We will use the function tf.constant and then we can start indexing. This is our tensor and it has the value 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6. Shape is 7 and the data type is integer 32. Suppose we want to print all the values of x, we will use indexing x colon colon and print. So this will print all the tensor 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6. Now we want to skip the first element and print all the remaining element then we can use something like this print x one column one means we don't want to print the first element except the first element print all the elements as you can see this will skip the first element which is 1 and print all the remaining element 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6. If you want to print first 5 element, we can do something like this. Print x 1, 2, 6. This works like it will take into consideration the last one and subtract 1 from it. 6 minus 1, 5, it will print from 1 to 5. Whenever we are passing the last index, it will always subtract 1 from it and then print the result. We can also print the element in the reverse order. It will print 6, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. For that, we have to do x colon colon minus 1. Now, this will print the elements in the reverse order. Suppose we want to print all the elements, but we want to skip every second element. We can do something like this. Column, column. Now we want to skip every second element. So we will take 3 because it will subtract 1 from it. 3 minus 1, 2. Now print it. So we can see it has print 1, 4, 6. Now this is the complete tensor. So it has print the first element 1, then it has skipped next to 2 and 3, it has print 4, now it has again skipped 5 and 6, now it has print 6. So this is how we can print all the elements and we can skip as number of elements we want. We can also do something like this. 4. So now it will print only 1 and 5. It has skipped after, uh, it has skipped every third element while printing. We will look at reshaping of index. So we will make one tensor and then we can reshape the tensor. Let's go and see. We will use the function range to generate tensor. So we have a tensor having element 0 to 8. 9 minus 1, 8. Now we want to reshape this into 3 by 3 matrix, 3 rows and 3 columns. So we can use the function tf.reshape. Let's go and see tf.reshape. And what we are reshaping? X. We want to reshape in 3 by 3 dimension, 3 rows and 3 columns. Let's print this. So you can see in the above example where x was a vector, it has values 0 to 8. 
now we have converted that vector into a matrix and we have done that using the function reshape so it has converted that vector into a matrix into 3 by 3 this is three columns and three rows so this is how we can reshape a vector into a matrices this was a small tutorial on indexing and reshaping of tensor in the upcoming videos we will start developing some deep learning models i hope you enjoyed the tutorial thank you for watching